As everybody knows, the mother of all skills in youth basketball is ball control. And that's exactly what we'll be talking about in today's tip of the week, brought to you by 3 to 1 Sportscast. If you're a youth basketball player and you cannot handle the rock, you should not be playing basketball or spend more time working on your handles. In today's episode, I'll show you a few uh, more advanced uh, ball handling drills that you can do every single day to improve your ball control uh, to get more minutes on the floor. We'll just start to warm up with some machine guns on the side and then we'll move on to more advanced drills. Butt down, chest or chin up, right hand machine gun. You can do those drills every single day you should be doing those drills every single day to warm up machine guns, crossovers just to warm up between the legs and behind the back. As you get warmed up, we can move on to a little more advanced uh, 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 movements, more advanced drills. We're gonna go sway, okay? Let's sway it, sway dribbles when you go inside, outside like a, a V dribble, one-handed crossover. If you do something with one hand, you gotta do it with the opposite. And I'm swings, just like a sway, but on the side, back and forth. And I'll swing on the other side. Okay, we're gonna move on now to going same hand, with same hand between the legs. I'm, I'll be going from my right hand to my right hand uh, between the legs. I'm going to take a dribble on the side, right to right. This one is going to be, oops, this one's going to be challenging for a lot of the players. Left to left, dribble on the side. I'm going to put this together with the sway dribble. I'm going to go sway, sway uh, uh, through. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, and I would left hand, one, two, three, four. These are really good drills to warm up. I'm going now to go with, uh, I'm gonna to put together the sway dribble with the uh, same hand between the legs. So I'm going to go sway uh, through behind, sway through behind, sway through behind. One, two, three, uh, sway through behind, A. sway through behind, one, two. Uh, so really challenging. I just got in here, I'm not really that warmed up yet, uh, uh, but I'm sure that all the drills I'm doing now, they'll help me warm up for the day. I'm, do, I'm going to go sway through, double through, okay? Sway. Same hand uh, between the legs into like a regular between legs. So I go sway through, double through, sway through. If I'm doing it with the right hand, I just have to do it with the left. Sway through and double through. Oh, sway through. Sway through, double through, sway through. Let's go sway through, double through, behind the back, and that's going to be our last, uh, last drill today. Uh, you can just have fun with all the drills that you're doing. You can mix and match. Just be creative. Be creative. I go sway through, double through, behind the back. That way I'll be able to switch in my hands every time. Sway through, double through, behind, sway through, sway through, double through, behind. One, two. Not only are you working your hands, you're working your uh, uh, stamina, your conditioning, but also working on your brain. With like a five, six, seven uh, dribble sequence drill, you really have to focus on it. As you could tell, I messed up a couple of times. I wasn't focused. Uh, but you can make Make up any kind of, any amount of dribble, basketball sequence, and then try to drill it as many times as you can in a row without messing up. That's a 
really fun, yet challenging way uh, to get better. Uh, you do sometimes like 12, 13, uh, even 15 dribble, uh, uh, dribble sequences with my group training, with my individuals uh, to make sure that they pay attention to what we're doing, that they're focused on what we're doing. Because really the truth is if you cannot remember a 15 dribble sequence uh, move, uh, as a training, it's going to be hard for you to remember all the offensive and de defensive concepts your future coach might have you uh, uh, learn. So it is very important for you to work on your focus uh, every time you work on your ball handling or, or, or your shooting, because you have to be able to memorize uh, very sometimes complex offensive and de defensive uh, concepts on the fly. This was Coach P's Tip of the Week, brought to you by 3 Sportscast. I'll see you guys next week.